let's create. First draw a pot. At the bottom, by a light stroke of pencil, now draw the edges of pot. Draw the pot without dark outline. Let me show you, I use the HB pencil. Add some design, draw the pot with a light stroke, and then draw the structure of stem and branches. I completed the sketch. Let's paint it. I am using the Camlin poster colors to paint. I started with the light green color. To paint the area below flower. I finished the color to the area below flower. I am using the brown color to paint the pot. I started coloring pot with the top side. I used the dark green color to paint the stem and branches of plant. Just paint the branches in the stem with a light stroke of brush. Remember that to use always thick color while painting, don't add more water in color because if you add more water, the color become very transparent and the page gets wet. For this, whenever you paint, always use thick color Now I am using the light green and yellow mixture to paint the leaf of the branches. Let's complete it. Now let's draw the main part of painting, the red roses. Use the light red color to paint the flowers. Remember to not allow color to go out. Form the border of the flowers. When you are painting the flowers always, dip the brush in color and then paint because the brush get dry faster. Use a small size of brush for more accuracy. Do the following steps as shown in the video. If you like my video, please press the like button and subscribe to my channel and comment what would you like to watch in next video. Finally, the third flower is completed. Start coloring flower from the edges to the middle. It helps to don't spread color outside the flowers. Let's enjoy watching the video. I'm using the Camlin color pencils to detailing. I start detailing from leaves. I am using the shadow and bright technique to add details on leaves. Use light and a little dark color pencils to detail the leaves. Add dark color on middle and light on the border of the leaves. I am adding more leaves below the big leaves. It looks more beautiful. Apply the same technique for this, but give the dark green on the border and let the green on the middle of leaves. I also added the details on the pot by using a little dark brown color pencil. Add some tiny flower on the side of rose. Add details on the roses. Use a light red and a dark pink or light brown color pencils to add details on rows give the proper shadow and bright the area of rows according to their borders. Let's paint the floor by using dark yellow, light brown, light orange color pencils. I'm giving the texture to the floor like wooden strips. Add vertical lines on the yellow color and give the border with brown color. Give the mixture of dark yellow and orange on the middle. Add shadow of the pot and give light sky blue to the background. Final results. Thanks for watching.